The first Top of the Hill ceremony was held. The program was created to honor outstanding alumni from Hopkinton High School. The event was hosted by Hopkinton High School, the Hopkinton Parent Teacher Association, the Hopkinton Education Foundation, and the Hopkinton 300th Anniversary Committee. Honored in the first class of inductees was Paul Phipps, class of 1939, Mary Harrington, class of 1954, Thomas McIntyre, class of 1972, Denise Millard, class of 1992, Megan Altador, class of 1995, and Sean Terry, class of 2005. Son of Paul Phipps, Rob Phipps, accepted the honor on behalf of his late father. My dad had a, as I said, a very long, full, and, uh, and happy life. Um, his glass was always half full. In fact, I'd say it was 90% full. That's how we looked at life. Um, his, I think his character, his attitude, everything was formed in Hopkinton. Uh, his ability to, well, as I said, to be humble, uh, to be sincere and honest and generous, all started here in Hopkinton, back when the town had 2,500 people in it. It, 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 it feels a little different. Uh, it, you know, obviously, I, I'm not the one the attendee honor is intended for, but I was happy and honored to receive it on behalf of my dad. He's been gone now three years, and uh, it's nice to know that people still remember his accomplishments and time spent in Hopkinton and uh, his giving spirit, and uh, this I accept that in his behalf, and I'm honored to do that. Um, now, uh, what do you think he would say to high school kids now? What, what advice do you think he would give them? <laughs> he tell them to go in the service, <laughs> which might not go over too big. Uh, but it was a big character builder for him going away and, uh, and seeing all the different cultures that everybody in this country represented and meeting Australians and, uh, and uh, Brits and French. Uh, it, it opened his eyes, really, after coming from a small town in Hopkins. So he would recommend that, you know, hey, a couple of years in, in service, whether it's Peace Corps or the military, would be good for everybody. As a lifelong resident, fifth generation Hopkintonian, it makes me very proud. I look back to the years when I went to high school on Main Street from 8 to 1 with a 15-minute recess for lunch. I, I look back on my uh, parents who taught my father taught me the love of Hopkinton, and my mother taught me the appreciation of community service. Well, it's a wonderful honor, and uh, it solidifies my love of Hopkinton and the roots that I have here as a fifth-generation Hopkintonian. So it was a tremendous honor, and I'm very grateful. All right, uh, do you have any advice for uh, high school kids? To study hard and to be yourself and to follow your dreams. I mean, all I ever wanted to do was drive a truck and run bulldozers. So how cool is that? That came true. So, But uh, giving back to Hopkinton, it's so easy to do. I mean, it's, it's the only place I know. I never lived anywhere else but Hopkinton. And, uh, you know, I think you learn. You think you learn a lot from your parents as you're growing up. But I think you learn more after you have kids of your own and they go through the school and you see what they do at the school. I mean, they do so many volunteer things from, tur you know, the turkey drives to helping unload Christmas trees for the Lions Club, and, and the baseball team would go there and do this and that, and, and you really learned a lot, and I think that's where, you know, later in life I started to, wanted to do these projects and things, because I obviously love Hopkinton. Oh, well, it's quite an honor. I never expected something like this. Uh, I'm so proud to be in the first class of of the honorees at the top of the hill. Yeah, I know. It's uh, everybody knows hill is rule, so <laughs> it's a great it's a great opportunity, and I'm glad I could be. All right. Do you have any advice that you would give uh, high school kids uh, here at Hopkinton now? Just go after your dreams. That's all you can do, yeah. and and uh, everything will work out right. So just believe in yourself. Yeah. <laughs>